YouTube video on uh, how to make a bungee launch and ramp. It's going to be a real quick tutorial. Um, this is Flying for Jesus here in Climate Falls. I'm going to have Brian Ferguson. So what we're going to get started with is you're going to need 30 feet of bungee uh, because you're going to double, double it up to make um, or 10 meters of bungee. We're going to fold it in half. So it's going to be 15 feet of doubled up bungee. And then you're just going to want to tie a knot in the end because that's where you're going to tie your parachute cord to. So you're going to want, I use high vis parachute cord um, for, the, for the launch so you can see it in the field. Um, you're going to need some one inch uh, pipe. This is a, this is your standard water pipe, Home Depot. Actually, this is three quarter inch. You're going to need four elbows right here. Um, you're going to need two T's for the legs. And then I'll give you all the dimensions. And uh, I've already got my bungee or my parachute cord cut. I got a 10 foot peak. I've got a six foot six peak. And I've got a three foot six piece. So that's my three different lengths. Um, the long one goes from the bungee to the first D ring. You're gonna need you're gonna need two D rings um, to tie. And you also need three stakes, which I don't have the three stakes here. But I'll show I'll show you in a other video when I do my maiden on my Sky Hunter how to set it all up. So what I've done so far is I've taken my bungee, folded it in half, um, and I got my knot tied in it. So there's my knot. So the first one, you take the you take the ten foot piece of paracord and you get it on you tie it on there. And I'll do a quick clove hitch with a with a a clove knot with a half hitch on it, just to be real quick about it. And you, you guys, if you don't know your knots, you could just, you know, go online, you know. So there's your first knot. Then you take your first D ring right here. Do a bowling on this one. Um, so there's the bowling knot. So you, and then you take the other two up, two, take your three six and your six six. And you tie both of these on here. Any knot you want is fine. You know, it doesn't really matter. There we go. So on the short one, that's going to be your launch to your plane. So we're going to tie this other D-ring on it. Again, I'm just doing quick knots so it doesn't make the video too long. So that's to your plane. And then this one, this is going to be your stake. It's going to be your launch point here to your stake. So there you go. That's to the plane. Go behind the launch ramp to your stake to step on it. So here's the launch system, the ramp. Get our tape, I'll give you the measurements real quick. We got two pieces of conduit cut. I've got them at 57 inches. I've got two pieces cut at 17 inches. There's those two. And I've got four pieces cut at five inches. I got two for the back legs cut at three inches. So we're going to take the first, and you don't need to glue these together except for the top where we're going to cut. Put those two on. Put our legs on for our front. cutting these so you're going to want glue on it for sure. So there's that one, it's glued. And then these ones will go. So there's one ramp. There's 
your ramp. And uh, you also want to take a take a piece of rebar, stick it through, and then it'll slide back and forth. And then I put a stake right here um, to hold it down. So when you go to get your bungee up, after you stretch it, you want to set your set point. And I got a fish scale. So this will go to the bottom of the plane right about there. This one will go past where you're going to launch because you'll launch your plane from right here. So step on it, away it goes. Then I'll, I'll show you on the setup of the plane where to put your hook and all that. So anyway, so thanks for watching the build for the launch bungee. I also wanted to show you guys uh, the other thing on this drag on this uh, launch cord is uh, you want to drag shoot some type of rag. You want it 10 inches back from your hook here. That way when you launch, it uh, slows the rope down to allow it to release from your plane. So this is just a quick tutorial. You know, I'm actually not going to use this big of a rag, but uh, get it on there nice and tight, about 10 inches from your eye, eyelet, the way it's going to go in your stick for your launch step. And the other thing is, on these guys, you know, it's going to take a saw. You've got to actually cut this piece off. That's why we had to glue this one. So we're going to... Smooth it up with a with a file or whatever. So you want to cut that down so when your plane goes across, it's not going to hit. Anyways, so there you go. There's a tutorial.